Hey guys, good evening. This is Luciano with you here on this beautiful Sunday night from Orlando, Florida. I just got home from a uh, an incredible weekend. Uh, actually, one that I wasn't even planning on going. Uh, to tell you the truth, but uh, I ended up calling a couple of friends, and they were coming, and they had um, some some extra tickets, so I, I had the opportunity to go. But uh, I tell you what, it's one of those. You know, this is the reason that we always tell people. Um, you know, you never, you should never miss a, uh, uh, never miss a function, because you never know what you're gonna hear, or what's what, what's gonna happen that might just hit you, and and you know, or you might hear something that might just trigger something else. So, so this, uh, so this was one of those weekend. You know, I mean, I, I, you know, we we finished at five o'clock, but uh, finished five o'clock on Friday, five o'clock Saturday, uh, four o'clock today. But you know, I just got home like maybe ten minutes ago, and then. The other night, I was getting home around 9, 10 o'clock at night. I mean, that's the kind of information, meeting after the meeting, all the stuff that was happening. So I uh, got a chance to sit uh, with, you know, with chat, chatted with Ray uh, Higdon a little bit, but also got a chance to sit with another mentor that, um, you know, a guy who's pretty incredible. Um, I don't know, most of you guys probably don't know him, but his name is Sean. And uh, just chit-chatted about the business and, you know, and, and you know, talking about, you know, this is a brand new year. We are just entering 2018. You got a blank uh, page. You got 300. Well, now you got two, 300 and something days left of your of your blank page. And what are you gonna do for for the rest of this of this 2018? But I got excited because look, I you know I I I heard some things and I learned some things and 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 I you know and I and I got some information from people that are that are out there speaking on stage. Some incredible people. Uh, I had never heard of this couple. You know. Um, Larry and uh, and uh, and Taylor Thompson, um, I had never heard of him. But this guy, Larry, has been uh, in the profession for 50 years, and I think Larry Thompson was one of those guys that, uh, uh, when when Herbalife was going from 90 million a month, 10 million a month, he was the guy that actually, one you know, one of the person that was very instrumental in bringing them up to to the life, you know. And he was there, and he was doing some sharing, and uh, man, I got excited because he he was saying some things that. Everybody, all of us know. So, so it's not that we don't know those things. It's just that you know they put it in a you know different perspective. You know, so, so, so you know it's not, it's not nothing earth shattering. But I think that the perspective that they they put it in was was very interesting. And you know they talk about the foundation of the business. Now think about this: these guys were in business fifty years ago when you had no technology. You didn't even have. He he said they didn't even have television. You know, and uh, and um, and now you know when you look at it today and all the technology that we have and obviously the products that we have. He named the companies that were around back then. I think it was like four or five company total, uh, and now there's thousands of different companies. You know, but but I'll tell you. Um, so I, I had a chance to listen to him. I had a chance to talk to him a little bit. I had a chance to talk to talk to another guy, Garrett Mc, McGrath, who also lives in Dallas. He's the president of the. Uh, network marketers, uh, 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 network marketers uh, professional association, and he's the president of that. He, I guess they just named him the president this year, and you know, and he was talking, and some of the things that he that he was saying was very interesting, you know. And and he wasn't saying this from stage. I just had a chance for me and a couple of people to to talk to him on the side, and he was saying, guys, see, this is he says what we have in network marketing, nothing can touch it. He says, and and the he says, and the thing is this. He says, and the future of this is going to be like, you know, it's going to be companies that have health products that can prove it scientifically. And, and, you know, and he knew about Manatech. He knew about, you know, the history of Manatech. He knew lots of things about Manatech. And he says, and I'm telling you guys, you guys got it. He says, you got the products and you got the science to back it up. And, you know, he's not even in Manatech. You know, he's in another company. So, so you, you know, there was a lot of things that just, you know, just like, just you know, put the put you know put that put the, the the nail in you know just just you know uh, give more credibility to what we're doing. But what I want to talk to you tonight is something that was that you know that was very simple. But you know we we know it. But you know we 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 just don't we don't think about it the way that these guys are talking about it. You know, and uh, and I think you know when you look at the foundation of the of the of the of the industry. And as a whole, um, you know, this is very interesting because 
when you look at your group, my group, anybody's group, and when you look at you know the 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 the, the industry as a whole, um, you see that uh, the foundation of most of our organizations are. 80% of the people are pretty satisfied with just making an extra $500. You know, they don't want to make more than that. They don't keep to make more than that. They don't want to do the work to make more than that. Uh, and they're just satisfied. They make $500 and that's it, you know. And 15% of the people in our organization, 15%, they are satisfied with making $2,500 a month. And they don't want to do any more than that. You know, they don't care if they do any more than that. But they are satisfied with $2,500 a month. And 5% of the people are satisfied with $2,500 a week. And, and Larry Thompson was talking about this. You know, I mean, this, this guy is a legend, you know. And he's a legend in the industry. Um, he pretty much brought back Herbalife from, from, from death. And he was saying, he, says, he said, look, if you look at your organization this way, then you realize that the only thing that you're doing is you're going, you're going through a, a, a session of sifting through people and, uh, and, and finding the ones that uh, want to be customers, finding the one that wants to be associate. But, you, but even but so when you find the one that want to be customer, just let them be customers. You know? Uh, you know, I know in the past myself, you know, I try to go in and show the, the business plan and whether they want to be customers or, 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 or build a business. We're still like, you know, we're still, you know, you know, talking about um, um, customers and talking about, you know, business, even though they might be interested in products. We still did it. So he was saying, look, he says, uh, when you find people, if they want to be customers, let them be customers. If they want to be associate, let them be associate. He says, but the bottom line is, no matter how you look at your organization, he says, the majority of the people in the organization. They're not out to go build a big business that's going to pay him big money and, you know, and make him, you know, give him the residual income to have a, life, a lifestyle change. So he says, so if you think about 80% of your people are pretty happy if they make $500 a month, he says, then, hey, you know, you don't have to talk about 10 million, you know, or 1 million or 100,000 or 200,000 uh, to the ones that are not interested, you know. He says, then, you know, in the 15%, they that want, that, that want to just make $2,500 a month. Fantastic. He says, that's what they want. That's what they shoot for. You help them get it. He says, your business is going to get bigger. Your volume is going to increase. And in the meantime, you know, you are, you know, your business is going to get solid because these people are getting exactly what they want. And then the 5% that want to make 2,500 a week, that's the, the people that you're going to spend, you know, the time with to help them, help them build a business and, and really uh, begin to mentor them and teach them and, you know, and, and help them to get to their level because those are the people that are going to take your business and their business to the next level. He says, but all those other people, you love them, you give them information. He says, those people are just as important as the people of the business builder. He says, if not even more. Because I was talking to a lady who in the last 10 days, this lady has brought in 100 customers in her downline and did 16,000 PV. She didn't say how she did it. You know, nobody said how she did it. She said, I think, mostly through social media. But can you imagine that? 10 days, 100 customers, 16,000 PV. I was like, my goodness. So I guess the reason I wanted to put this up and talk to you guys about it is, 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 is this. Look. No sense in, in trying to stress over making somebody be something that they don't want to or do something that they don't want to uh, 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 you know, at the time. Guide them and lead them and help them to achieve exactly what they're looking for in their business. You know? Um, and, and that's all we can do. There's, not, you know, we, there's, no other, there's no nothing else that we can do. Because now if we try to push anything outside of the boundaries uh we're creating stress you know we're creating relationship issues we're creating situations that are not necessary you know because those people already have their mindset this is what they want this is what they're satisfied with and so so that's it you know and 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 so so if you look at it that way 
then you don't have any stress because you know, hey, you know, this is what they want. This is what we're going to help them get. Uh, and then on top of that, now, when you start adding customers, your, you know, customer base and, you know, and your customer base is going to be your biggest volume producer, the biggest part of your business always, you know? So it was a, it was a very interesting weekend because, you know, n you know, not everybody that spoke, spoke about this type of thing, but the majority of the people that spoke spoke about, you know, the importance of customers in your business. Because obviously the, the, the Federal Trade Commission, you know, that's what they also say, hey, you know, you better have some customers. But I think everybody realizes and everybody knows that, uh, you know, the majority of the people who are going to be in your business are just going to be customers. And, you know, and they just, a lot of them just want to get their products. A lot of them want to get the products for free if they can. But the majority of them don't even care too much if they're making money or not making money. They just want to be customers, you know. And if the product works, you're going to have customers for long term. I mean, the, the, the Garrett, the guy who's the, the president of the, the Network Marketers Association, he says that's what uh, we have as a company at Manitech. That's what we have. We have the products that are backed by science. Then when people take it, they go, wow. They go, wow. And because of that, you know, people stay taking the products. And, uh, and I forgot what Manitech said the average people – how many years? I think it was seven or nine years. The average people, you know, stay taking the products even after they quit. That's huge because usually that doesn't happen. You know, and, you know, people quit. They're gone. They don't even turn around to try to take the products anymore, which I don't understand. But, but that is huge. So, so when you look at your organization, guys, and you're building your business, just remember something. 80% of the people are, are going to be satisfied with making $500. 15% of the people are going to be satisfied with making $2,500 a month and 5% of the people will be very excited about making $2,500 a week. And, uh, you know, and, 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 you know, he, he, he used an expression that was very interesting. He says, you know, what? you keep those people around the flagpole because you never know. And, you know, I mean, for those of you that were in the business a long time ago, you know, uh, Bill, Bill would, would always tell us that, hey, you know what, you, you know, whenever we have function, you know, just make sure that you get as many of your people there because once you get them there, you never know what's going to happen after that, you know. So that's what he meant by saying, hey, you know, um, um, you know, you keep them around the, the, the flagpole because as long as you keep them there, you know, and, and, and but the, 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 the thing is you keep, keep them around the flagpole but don't try to push them to go do something that they're not – plan on doing they're not interested in doing but you know if you keep them around the flagpole they they'll get excited they, you know or they might get excited but even even so guess what some people uh, they're around, uh, are they going to be around just because of the community simple you know they're going to be around just because of the community um so so and and you know and, and they don't care you know they'll come to everything they'll be at everything they'll They'll, you know, they'll, they'll, they'll invest on, on weekends and all that stuff, and they just like to be around the community. And that's fine, too, you know, because guess what? They're probably just customers who are going to be using the products, and you never know. Once in a while, they might have some people that they know that wants to use the product, too. So the, so, so the reason I'm sharing this with you guys is because, look, the mindset is this. Guys, you're going to build a business. You're going to build it and you're going to build it big, but let's build it where the people are at. Not trying to make people move and go do things that they're not, they don't want to or they're not ready to. So that means, you know, you just look for people and you put them, you know, where, where they, they, they want to be at. And by the way, talking about that, um, almost done with the, with the, with the group for uh, products. So maybe... Maybe uh, by maybe by next Sunday, um, next Sunday I won't be here because I'll be traveling. But maybe by next Sunday, or, uh, or maybe by the week after that when I come back home, we should be having it ready. Uh, we should be having the training group ready, where you know uh, we're gonna do a lot of the, the the stuff that you know, a lot of the videos, a lot of the training, uh, a lot of the brochure, you know, a lot of the brochures formed. That should be you know should be ready. Um, the, the, the product one is almost ready, you know, we're, but you know, and again, we're, we're concentrating on weight loss guys, 
One thing that was very clear this weekend was the people that are building the business, even though they have lots of different products, they're concentrating on the weight loss because you can show before and after, you can show the effectiveness of your products, and then you kind of bring in the rest of the product. You know, and, and that's how they're doing it. And they, you know, they're getting lots of positive results because who does not want to lose weight if they need to? Everybody, you know. So, so that one is, is, is almost done. And then uh, the next one that we're working on is, is, the, is the, the, the Ewing Global Academy, which is going to be the training site. And then we're going to duplicate that in Spanish also. But also uh, we're working on the business presentation site. So that means, you know, you don't have to do anything, guys. You plug people in there and let the tool work for you. One of the talks that, that, that we had this uh, weekend was third party tools 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 and i heard it i can't even tell you how many times you know there was a lady that was there never heard of her danny um danny robinson lady has hundreds of thousands of people in her downline you know from montana i know i think she's from from spokane washington uh, but i think originally she's from montana and then she moved to spokane washington and she talked about leading the tools to the work for you. So instead of you trying to go do everything for your organization, have the tools in place that you can just send people to and then let the tool do for you because then your, your organization then can use the same thing. They can send their people and let the tools work for them. So that's what I'm working on to create those kind of tools that you can send people, people to. And then, and then the, you know, so they, they talk about that. Um, so, so, so John Melton put it this way. He says, um, you know, it's the, you know, use the thing that will sell the thing, <laughs> you know, as simple as that, you, you know, use the things that will sell the thing, meaning, you know, don't, you, you don't have to go and, 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 and be the person who's passing the information, but little two pass the information for you, but then that's easy, easily duplicated. And, and, you know, and one of the things that, um, that, uh, that, that was very interesting was that, um, you know, all of them had the same, not the same topic, but, you know, they all hit kind of the same theme where, where it's like, you know, you know, you, you know, forget the past, the past is the past, nothing that happened in the past is going to help you in the future. Uh, so, you know, get, you know, just never mind the past, but you know, know that you can do it, know that you are awesome. Uh, and, and the other thing is, you know, you don't have to know exactly everything for you to be able to have success in your business. You don't have to go learn everything for you to have success in the business. You don't have to become an expert at everything for you to become successful in the business. You don't have to know everything about the plan. You don't have to know everything about the products. But as long as you are doing something by especially sharing your story. And, and you know, and, and again, that was one of those things that a lot of people talked about. Sharing your stories as you're meeting people and letting them know how you can help them. And I see, I'm, you know, the, 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 it was interesting because um, that was, that was, you know, that was, that was a lot of, a, a lot of the talk was based on that, you know, that, that you, uh, you know, it, you can help them build their business successfully, you know? And, 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 and if you, if, if you're building the business and you, Building the business to help other people have success, success, your business is going to grow. That one lady says, you know, if you think it's all about you, you're going to get on stage and you're going to talk. And then one day you're going to turn around. It's only, it's going, it's only going to be you listening to you talking, you know. So, so this, and these are the things that, you know, we all know. But sometimes we just need it to hear it again and hear it again and hear it again and hear it again. Because, you know, sometimes we just forget or sometimes we just get thinking differently and you veer off the track. I know I do. I veer off the track a little bit and maybe and I need somebody to put me back on that track. And I think this weekend is one of those weekends that just actually put you back in that track in terms of where you're going to go, how you're going to build the business and what, how you, you know, what, how, you know, how, how is the structure of, of the business and how the, what, what, what is it that the people that are coming and looking for something, what is it that they're looking for? You know, and there's a lot of people looking, guys, you know. There's a lot of people looking. Al, Al I was just listening to a, 
a talk that L did, I think last Saturday, and he was talking about, you know, you, you see all these, um, all, all these um, events that are taking place in different hotels as you, you know, you go to these hotels and stuff and you see the, the events of people looking to make money from home, especially Amazon or, 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 or Kiyosaki selling real estate. I mean, these places are packed. They are packed with people. Why? Because there's a lot of people out there looking to figure out a way to make extra money from home. Simple as that. And, 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 and you know, and then think about, think about the, what we have versus what they have. Because what we have is residual income. They don't have residual income in real estate sales or Amazon sales and none of that stuff. So what we have, when you compare it, uh, um, you know, um, compare it, and, you, you know, and you're talking to people about, you know, um, residual income and, uh, and how, you know, they, you know, you can change their lifestyle, change their life. It's way better than traditional business. It's way better than real estate. It's way better than, you know, doing something, you know, uh, to, to make money in e-commerce or that. I mean, that you can make money from those. I'm not saying those are, those, are, those are no good. Yeah, you can. But it's nice if you also have some residual income coming. So, <clears throat> you know, I, I hope, you know, that you get, get, got some value from that because I was sitting there and I was thinking, wow, you know, it's not any secret. But to know that, you know, 80% of the people are satisfied at $500 and 15% $2,500 a month and 5% $2,500 a week, it, said, it, said, it puts it in a different perspective in terms of how do I handle and, and massage and create the relationship in my organization that I need to. And if you are, if that, you know, if, and if you think in that way, then you know that you know you're gonna have some people who are gonna go fast, some people who won't go and be in the middle, and some people who just they're just happy with a little money, and then you're gonna have some people that just want to buy the product. And that, ladies and gentlemen, if we're thinking that way, we're gonna have almost no stress as we build our business because we just go with the flow. So hopefully that you know that has been helpful. It's giving you some some value, but uh, I'll give it to my friend Mr. Mike Geddes. Uh, as we um, finish tonight, but it's been a real, um, a real pleasure, a real, uh, real honor to be able to come and share this with you this week. And then uh, you know, I got tons of stuff that uh, that I learned this week, and we're gonna put in practice. Uh, I know I'm gonna be putting some of it in practice, but I'll be sharing it with you on our weekly training uh, next week. I'm not gonna be here because I'm gonna be traveling, but the week after that, I will, and I will share uh, more, more of some of the things that. Uh, that I think is going to be exciting for 2018. Guys, every single one of you deserve to achieve whatever goals that you have for 2018 in your organization. So with that, Mike, I'll give it back to you. I want to say good night to everybody. You guys have a fantastic week. Remember, you got blank pages. Go write whatever story you want for, for you and your family. Have a good night. Thanks, guys.